Hey, right, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toasty and today we are back with Final Fantasy Brave Exvius. You guys can see right here, Fravia, we're gonna talk about her because she got her abilities awakened and let's go down and look at them right now. So, we got Duelist Pose, which is increase uh, equipment attack by 100%. Once you awaken it once for 500,000 gil, uh, you basically get magic 100% also when single wielding a one-handed weapon. So if you guys uh, give her a needle, well, usually you only get 100% to attack and 50% to magic. And now you basically get 100% attack and 100% magic. Then, once you awaken a second time, um, you still get the same buff, 100% on attack and magic when single wielding any weapon. Plus, you get an increase in attack, defense, magic, spirit by 30% when equipped with a sword. So, she gets a big, big buff in her attack and her magic, which is really, really great because she does a lot of damage, guys. And when I say a lot of damage, it's a lot of damage and you guys are going to see right here in a second. Number two... Cold and Confident, increase HP by 10% and MP by 10, uh, 30%, uh, plus Ice Resistance by 30%. Once you awaken it a second second time, you basically get an increase in HP by 30% and an increase in Ice Resistance by 50%. So she's able to uh, take a little bit more Ice damage. And the buff in HP is really good, guys. Whenever you're able to get the increase in HP to one character, uh, it's always good to do it. Basically, it's not really expensive, 120,000 gil. Uh, so for a grand total of 240,000 gil uh, and it's guard crisp so not that bad it's actually really really good guys whenever you need to buff somebody up get their HP up so at least they're a little bit more resistance and they won't die as fast third because we're gonna finish with a big damaging move uh, second intention I bred damage 7.5 times to one enemy uh, that's a one hit guys so it's almost like a finishing move where you can use her to literally finish the chain uh, in the middle of something so you guys can see right here it's a 7 point times uh, 7.5 times multiplier to one enemy and at the beginning it was a six time uh, multiplier to one enemy so right here you guys can see a little increase in damage once you awaken a second time uh, you basically get a nine times multiplier to the one enemy but if it's used you guys can see right here if used after ice saber or frost flower bread, uh, blitz Hybrid damage, 12 times multiplier, guys. So that's really, really strong. Uh, unfortunately, power crits, uh, most of you guys probably enhanced Titus or Orlando, uh, Noctis, all these guys. So it took a lot of power crit. And right here, you guys can see it's more power crit. Uh, not that expensive, though. It's not a million, but still 500,000 gil total is not too shabby at all. To be honest, I don't know if we guys, um, if I would use her to chain finish uh, as more as a chainer, but nonetheless, it's always useful because she can do, sorry, even more damage with that. And the last one, which is the best one, which is a big money maker right here, big money maker, Frost Flower Blitz. Uh, Blitz. I have a hard time with that. Uh, ice hybrid damage nine times multiplier to one enemy so you guys can see right here originally it was eight times multiplier uh, you guys can see it's seven hits and this is where everything bec becomes really really cool so eight times multiplier decreases ice damage uh, ice uh, resistance by 50 percent so she imperils when she hits you guys can see right here attack frame changes and that's where it becomes really really good because we're gonna go right here see new attack frames you guys can see it's 70 77 82 89 96 103 and 110 what does that mean if we go right here to our friend orlando big daddy orlando right here we're gonna go see his frames 70 77 82 89 96 103 and 110 so yes <laughs> Fravia and Orlando can now chain together so if you guys don't have Orlando but you have a Fravia you have an Agrius in your party well you can chain Fravia and Agrius together uh, Veritas of the Dark whatever you guys want to chain them together they actually perfect chain together and that's cool because it's only one time 
So once you awaken once, you get that attack frame change, which is great. Uh, Black Crist, which is pretty amazing since you won't have to use your Power Crist. It's a million gil, but trust me, I'm gonna show you guys in this video, it's worth it. Once you awaken a second time, Ice Hybrid damage 10 times to one enemy, and Imperil 75% to Ice. So she does even more damage. The attack frame stays the same. She becomes a monster, guys. And just to show you how easy it is gonna be to chain with them, we're gonna go right here for a second. All right, we're gonna go here. I have the party ready. We're just gonna show you exactly what it looks like. It's gonna be really, really funny. So, I'll show you exactly what I did. She basically only has her needle. Lightbringer, why? Because I wanna use the light damage because I didn't have any um, ice sword for Orlando. So you guys will see right here. They're gonna perfect chain together, which is gonna be really funny and really, really strong. Let's load this up. Meaning, if you guys haven't beat the trials, let's say the robot trial, and you're still struggling there. Well, guess what? Now it's gonna be that much easier. So we're gonna target this little rat right here. We're gonna go right here. And... Perfect chain. <laughs> Which is pretty, pretty funny and pretty cool. So, like I said before, if you guys still don't have, uh, let's say, Orlando, but you do have Fravia, uh, we might see a little bit more of Fravia fans, uh, friends online now. I think people are gonna start using her a little bit more just because she's able to chain with more characters and that's pretty sweet. Also, her damage multiplier is really really high for, uh, for that and she also gets a big buff in her attack, which is pretty sick. We're gonna finish this dude. Wait, actually, you know what? Let's... Uh, if, if we're gonna kill the rat, might as well kill it, you know, the right way. We're gonna break his defense and spirit. There you go. And we're just gonna do this. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Rat. What's also really good, guys, if you haven't beaten Ifrit, the three-star Esper, she's gonna make that fight that much easier. Just the fact that she's gonna be able to imperil ice by 75%. And her needle has ice on it. She does hybrid damage, so she doesn't care if the defense or the spirit is there. She's just gonna hit and kill anything in her way. Guys, <laughs> she's really good. Uh, she has a lot of good stuff. I'm pretty sure we're gonna see more of her on your friends list and everything. And uh, she she's back, the queen of ice. The queen of ice is back, guys. I'm really happy about that, I'm stoked. I think I'm going to be able to use her a little bit more in my parties now because it was always hard to find a uh, Fravia friend there because you everybody knows Orlando is the easiest one to chain. But now, this girl is pretty easy to chain. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you do, please leave a like, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace!